Hey guys, welcome to our channel and this time we are going to study understanding settings in CG50, CAS CG50. So before you enter into any examination, uh, you must reset your calculator as explained previously. If you have not seen the video, you can click on the link at the top. So this time I'm going to talk about various settings uh, that your calculator has and the settings, please remember settings is different for different application. So let's say if you're in the matrix, go in there and then you push shift and menu to go into setup and you can do the necessary setup here. So I would suggest some of the recommended settings. So mode is composite, that should be okay. Uh, and then fraction result is the over shape, you can change it to ABC as well. Function type is ZV1 and then if you do some parametric or polar or implicit function, you can change it from here. Draw types it will be connect derivative of if you would like to plot derivative at times you can turn it on. Angles it will be radian. At times people make it degree, so you can do it degree as well. But I would suggest use catalog feature for uh, degree. If you don't know how to use catalog feature, you can click on the link at the top. So always try to keep it in radian because eighty percent and ninety percent of time you'll be doing in radian for AEP and IB both. Complex mode, real, yes, try, I would suggest you keep it A plus B I because uh, if you are solving a polynomial and uh, you know it does not have a real root, it would say no roots and you might get confused, so try to keep it complex. Coordinates should be on, grid line can be on and off as which wise. And this seems okay, so let's go back, let's go to statistics now and let's go to settings. So. Something that is important is your background, your sketch line, your angle, and your coordinates. Okay, if so, when you don't find your output very familiar, you can come back and you can see check out here. And you must also be able to see frequency here. Say a list file and. Uh, that's weird that should be frequency itself anyway right so uh, that should be there this is weird all right let's check out the settings for graph so uh, be very careful if you would like to draw simultaneous graph or derivatives or if you would like to you know try to Draw some, you know, graph fence and on of real screen. If you want to draw graph and you want to have table as well, so you can see change G to T, etc. Right, and don't forget to do the next setting for other application and your system as well. Always check that you have the updated OS by going to settings and hitting F4 3.2. Because every uh, six months gets your religious new OS, so please keep a, you know keep an eye on it so that when you get a new OS, you get better and more functionality and optimum results. And then you have the new 3.2, you can get five as well. All right, so hope you enjoy the video. I will make a new video very soon. I post uh, almost every Wednesday, so please stay tuned. Thank you very much. Have a good day.